Uh, again, so with, with you know, this is just the fact that uh, the hydrocarbons will move to the top of the reservoir. Um, and so you can often see this. This is, again, I think some real data from the Gulf of Mexico. And you'll see at the top of the reservoir, if I were to sort of draw a line through, so this is real pressure, pore pressure with depth. You can see at the, at the top of the reservoir, you kind of have these kicks. Whereas below that, if you, if you were to look at the, well, there's, there's a hydrostatic pressure gradient right there. So th this line represents hydrostatic pressure gradient. And you see that below the, below the top of the reservoir, everything increases hydrostatically. Whereas above it, where I've drawn these more vertical lines, you have this sort of increase in rate causing uh, you know, uh, an overpressure scenario due to, uh, due to just the presence of hydrocarbons in the top. Um, thought we'd get done early today, but uh, I think I'm just going to stop there.